apparently it's left trigger. Cool. Okay, I can't listen here. Sounds clear. Oh dear. A lot of dead birds. Firewood. That works. A bunch of items piled up any which way. I used to climb into empty wardrobes like this playing hide and seek as a girl. game is spooking me yeah this game is it does a very good job of uh just keeping you on your toes the atmosphere is well done have a good night grim sage wood to catch fire. Okay, so I guess I still don't have what I need. Hmm. Maybe there was something upstairs. Did I have to, like, soak the rag in gasoline or something? Maybe alcohol? Dear eccentric husband, I left your key in the top drawer of your bureau in the library. The children have been very nervous lately. We need to talk about this as soon as you get back, and I don't want them playing with it. Uh, let me take a look at that note one more time. Okay. Making sure we didn't miss anything up here. Yeah, I think there was fuel up top, too. I'll check that out in just a second. Where did this go? Okay. Oh. Wait, what? Bicycle. What? Huh? Old metal box. Uses.
I love motorcycles. Here's the boiler. It is receiving no electricity like the rest of the house. Boiler functioning upper panel. Shut down, press left button, start, press center button, emptying, press right button. In case of malfunction, prevent correct boiler functioning. You can perform an emergency shutdown by keeping the blue button pressed for four seconds. Okay. We need to get electricity first from the looks of it. We have fuses now, though. We just gotta find a panel somewhere. Excuse me, Mr. Co-Carnage. What is your middle name so I can yell at you about that dog? Let's go back up. Oh, try opening. Oh. This might be a terrible idea. <sighs> you need electricity for garage door opener. That makes a scary amount of sense. Shadow of Prowls. Hey, Code, love the stream. Keep up the good work. Will you be doing an Assassin's Creed playthrough or a Ratchet and Clank playthrough? Uh, we're definitely checking out Valhalla. I'm not quite sure on Ratchet and Clank yet. Um, maybe down the road at some point. But yeah, we'll, we'll definitely be checking out Valhalla. Seeing how it is. You missed a door in the room before the garage. Thank you. Let's take a look. Okay, that's a battery. Was there a gas can out here? Maybe it was somewhere else. No, maybe not. Okay. We're doing Raft next week? Yes. And Baldur's Gate 3. Hmm. Hey, Dub Live. What's up, buddy? Can we do anything in the area with the... Crap door. Let's look here. Okay, the top part is the battery. Bottom right is the trap door. We don't have anything sticky yet for the bottom left. Hmm. Guess the can I thought was actually plant food. Oh, that's fine. Can't do anything here yet. Taking a look in here real quick. Make sure there's not like a fuse box in the bathroom or something. Okay. Oh, actually. Mm -mm. Oh, okay. Someone bolted that one. I guess if we look at this, it'll tell us if there's something we can use in there, which is super handy. So we know that we're good up here, basically. I'm looking down here. Yeah, there's another door in there we can check out. Hmm. 
Hmm. Maybe we can go around that gate on the front now? The door next to it? What about this door? This, this door goes to the garage. What do you mean over here? Oh, okay, and now it's done completely. Nice. Oh, this is good. Chat, why do you lead me to these places? Uh, Kane Lel, yes, this is this is Super Mario Sunshine. stuck on the safe. Dear Julia, if you found this note, congratulations. You're one step closer to solving the puzzle I prepared for you. I hope it keeps you entertained while I'm away. I've hidden your favorite doll in the safe and changed the combination. Since you aspire to become a detective when you grow up, I think this is a great chance to put your deduction skills to the test. The new combination is as follows. The number of our street address, Saul's age, the decade and year, the canvas hanging upstairs right next to the staircase, was painted. Good luck, my dear inspector. Hugs and kisses from daddy. Oh, Lord. Number of our street address. Saul's age. Decade and year. The canvas hanging upstairs, right next to staircase. Could just you know open this up again but ah! we have time for that ain't nobody got time for that uh i believe it is 420 69 69 69 yes that's right huh. i think there's some x's in there somewhere too supposed to know which of the boxes on the top corresponds to which of the ones on the left. All the wires are the same color. Um, maybe it's just the left. Maybe they just line up. Left, middle, right, left, middle, right. Um, Okay, so if you have to do 25. Oh no, that can't be right. Because. Hmm. So. If we look at the, the one on the left, it takes three inputs. The one on the right takes two inputs, and the one in the middle takes two inputs. 
So one of them is going to have to be 20 and 10, and one of them is going to have to be 15 and 10. Am I colorblind? No. No, no, no. No, the, 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 I'm sorry. The wires that I'm talking about are the ones connecting to the left. So, basically what I was trying to figure out is the three boxes on the top, there's, a, there's blue, red, green, and yellow wires that connect to those boxes. But now we need to figure out the three boxes on the top, how they correspond to the three fuses on the left, where we need to make the things on the left equal up to those. So, if you look... The top left box has three wires going into it, so it can't correspond to the left one because the left one can only take two. So it would be different if the yellow and black alternating wires were different colors, but they aren't. So knowing that, we have to assume the middle and the right one are the 25 and 30s. And now we just need to figure out how that works. So what we need to do is how will we get 50 out of this? And we have to use 25. So it would be 50, 10. Okay, so basically 25 is only going to connect to there. Um, that one's going to be the 50. And then if that's the 50, it also needs to connect to the red and the green. The green connects to 2 as well. So the one that connects to 2 is going to be the 10 because we need 25 and 30. Knowing that, this one can be either. So, if we assume that the top right one is the 25, oh no, no, it's not. Because to equal 50, this would have to be 15, and then this would have to go here. Yeah. Okay. Great. So, we got it. some why oh okay so now we need to figure out there's a wire not making contact somewhere is that the wire up by the sink we can use the rag to clean up the spill. I mean, we'll electrocute ourselves, but you know, whatever. It's fine. Although it's kind of weird. Why is that wire sparking? I just realized that doesn't make any sense. There's no electricity, right? Was it sparking? I think it was sparking. It's a game! Thank you. You're right. Sorry, chat. Sometimes I'm just so dumb. that did it? You would think we would have to wrap the wire or something, but maybe not. Let's go check. <clears throat> oh, also, I just realized something. Saul, seven. Okay. So we know that Saul's age is seven. What is the street address here? We have that information somewhere, right? Isn't that... Damn. 
Cat's saying four. Okay. I mean, I believe you, chat. But I'm going to go look. Maybe we can look at the mailbox outside or something. Maybe it says it on the front of the door. I wanted to check the gate out here anyway. Hmm. Daniel's car is here. Okay. Oh, no street address. Totally jammed. Hey, Raziel. Thank you for the 77 months, Raziel. Really appreciate that. Thank you. 77 months, my lord. Good God. Gotta be an address somewhere. Even the kitchen? Yeah, I saw that too, Dark Rob, but it won't let me read it. So, I saw that on the bottom right of the, like here, if we look here. Let's see down there, it says 841. Is that it? It's really hard to read. But maybe that's just like something else. An 841 doesn't seem like the first number of a safe combination, you know? Unless it's like in the thousands. Maybe. The letter from the shop owner. Maybe it's on the. That is the house number, not the street number. Okay. Try turning the power on. The letter on the door with the first character has address. Yeah, but I don't think that letter's there anymore. It said that the characters all are going to drop their items, but I don't think the very first character counts as a death because we're trying to find him. Could be wrong. face. We got power, boys. Finally. If you're here, 
I'm going to find you. Huh. Guess I might as well keep it on. Okay, let's take a quick look at this. Hmm. Okay, yeah. So it has to be like the last the last tip is decade and year the canvas hanging upstairs was painted. First of all, thanks, chat. Decade and year? So we know that's going to be seven. It's got to be like a really early painting. Because it can't be double digits. Yeah, look at this. Brute force it? I mean, we easily could. Oh. for right next to the staircase upstairs. Okay. Uh Brian uh Brian Hart, we're we're probably going to check out uh, uh Phasmagoria Phasmophobia, excuse me. <laughs> tomorrow at uh 3 p.m. Oh. Uh-huh. It's missing. It's an oval painting. See a number out there? No. Where have we seen an oval paint? <laughs> Something terrible is drawing near. You will need to hide before it's too late. Look around you and find a place we can go undetected. Once you've interacted with a hiding place, it will appear in the map with the following symbol. Time is short. Run hold LT. Oh, there's a wardrobe. Get in. You managed to hide from the darkness, but the worst is yet to come. Try to keep a level head to calm down. Follow the rhythm of your heartbeat by pressing LTRT when the center white border reaches the center of the circle. Don't let your heart beat too fast or you'll start to panic. Above all else, don't look at it. real or, or am i imagining things damn <laughs> okay <laughs> okay okay Even my childhood memories are as old as these toys. Okay, is the door in here? Oh, we can open. We can. Oh wait, nothing in here, right? No, nothing in here. We can open the um, the garage. Now. Let's see if the door. Coin to your witcher. Hey, Paige. Scary movie games are not my forte, but I watched Cope play them the last few years. This year has been crazy with COVID, but I found the love of my life. So best year ever. I am okay, Paige, with a $30 tip. K Paige, thank you for the support and congratulations. 
That is awesome. A little bit of a silver lining in a gray year. That's great to hear. Thanks for sharing it with us.